Hello everyone and welcome back to HUD Bricks. Today we'll be taking a look at the LEGO James Bond Aston Martin DB5. This set is set number 10262. Was released in 2018, had 1,290 pieces, and was a LEGO Creator Expert line. I absolutely love these giant LEGO Creator Expert vehicles, and I think this is great, iconic, and epic. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this review. This isn't your average Creator Expert vehicle, this is James Bond's vehicle. So it has tons of cool features, including changing license plates, machine guns, and many more. So first, let's take a look at this special feature, which is the changing license plate. You can see all of the different license plates, but the one that is more of an Easter egg is JB007, James Bond Agent 007, which I thought was pretty cool. The rest of these, I mean, they don't mean a whole lot to me, I don't know. Comment down below if you know if these are any Easter eggs, but they just really look cool. And these are actually chairs right here, used right there in the light blue gray color, and I think it's really cool. And I love all these chrome pieces on the outside. Now, these may just look like regular headlights right there, but if you pull on the brake, they turn into machine guns. I absolutely love that feature and I think it looks really cool, including these exclusive printed pieces right here for the grills at the front, and a stickered piece right there that says Aston Martin, which I think is really cool and really awesome. You've also got these pieces right here, which are actually shield pieces, just with a transparent dish at the top. Moving across the side, you can see this door here, it opens up, and I love how with these Creator Expert vehicles, it stops right there like a real car, it can't swing all the way, and that feels so realistic and great. But as I turn it this way, you can see a gear there, let's go ahead and see what that does. I don't know if it's a little dark in there, but when you turn the gear, it, that grill or that AC in the middle, you can see there are just some grills there, turns into a super computer, which is really cool and is an awesome, awesome feature. And as I turn the side, you can see those great detailed seats. You've also got the brake here, which makes the machine guns turn, which I think is pretty dang cool. And as I turn it around to the other side, you can see some extra details, including the steering wheel right here, which can move up and down, some gauge on the back and a secret compartment here with a secret phone that is red. That reminds me of the bat phone but I absolutely love that feature. One last thing we've got DB5 which is another sticker and I love all the small little stickers that have wording on them and extra detailing. I also love this tile right here that is a chrome silver tile and it's a 2x4 tile so that's a great piece to be able to get and I absolutely love that in this set. In the back you can see we've got another revolving license plate which just turns around it has the same exact license plate and is the same design as the last one but up here we've got another one of those Aston Martin stickers and the trunk can actually open up and this is a part of another feature I'll show you in a little bit but the cool thing is in these exhaust pipes in the back you can actually twist one of them and a bulletproof shield goes up, which I think is really cool. Sometimes it does get stuck, but it's really fun and great for your car chases. You can also see these headlights, um, I guess backlights at the bottom, and I think these look great with all of those transparent studs. And you can see right here we've got one last feature. Alright, I've got to show you the whole car to be able to show you this feature. So this has to be my favorite feature of the Aston Martin, which is an ejector seat. So in the back I showed you earlier, you just pull this lever and boom, it ejects. And the faster you do it and the harder you do it, it actually can go out higher. I absolutely love that feature and I'm so happy with how it turned out. I do have one complaint about it though, that in the back window that you can see all the mechanism that is used there. I mean, that's not too horribly bad, but it still doesn't look very good. You can see some extra sticker detailing here. And the last feature is that in the trunk, you have these extra pieces right here. And you can take off these ninja stars on the tires, put that there, and then put the ninja star on. And it's supposed to kind of be like that can pop other tires. And as you're going along, yeah, it pops other cars' tires that might be following you. I think that's really cool. It's actually a really popular feature of the Aston Martin. But I wish that you could have, like, pushed the other tire and that would come out of this one. But, I mean, they would have had to make a lot of new pieces for that and everything. So, I mean, I'm happy with that. 
So that about wraps this up. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you went on to enjoy this video and if you really like this set or if you have this set, give this video a big thumbs up so it can get out to more people or share it. Also, be sure to comment down below and tell me any of your thoughts, any ideas or anything else that you have to say. Tell me if you have this set, if you want this set or any other thoughts you have. Also, if you aren't already, be sure to subscribe with notifications on so you don't miss any of my other LEGO reviews, mocks, brick films, and more. And I'll see you next time on HUD Bricks. Doo-doo-doo!